Hello friends, the title of this story is, The Lost Shoes. Hersh was a messy boy who never used to keep his things in right place. Mummy always told him that he should take care of his belongings. But he never hear Mummy's advice. It was a bright morning and Hersh was getting ready for school. He was super excited for school today as there was a school picnic today. After getting dressed up was all set to go to school. So he looked for his shoes and they were not in the rack. He looked for them under the bed but they were not there. He was getting late but he didn't know where to look for them. Mom was upset with his reply and said, Oh dear if you will not take care of your belongings then you will lose every opportunity of your life. See how will you go to picnic today without shoes? The school bus was now standing at the doorstep but Hersh had no shoes. Sadly, Hersh missed the bus. Hersh remembered that after the school he was playing in the park and he put off his shoes there to climb a tree. Mom I think I have left my shoes in the park, replied Hersh. Suddenly the doorbell rang and Papa came home. Hersh saw Papa was holding Hersh's shoes. Papa smiled and said, I saw your shoes in the park during my morning walk, don't be so careless again. Seeing this Harsh jumped with joy. Oh my shoes, my shoes, see Mama, Papa got my shoes from the park. Papa looked at the clock and said, aren't you late for the picnic dear? Hersh sadly replied, Sorry, Papa, I missed the bus. Papa said, Oh, I think we are not that late. Come, let's catch the bus. Hersh quickly wore his shoes and Papa started his scooter. They caught the bus in the next stop. That day after enjoying his picnic, Hersh promised his parents that he will always take care of his belongings and will never repeat this mistake again. The lesson we should learn from the story is that we should keep our things in their right places and take care of our belongings, otherwise we can lose big opportunities in life also. Friends if you like the story, please like, share and subscribe to hear more such beautiful stories.